I'd be remiss if I didn't ask you about another show you were on uh, relatively close to this one. And that was, I saw you pop up in Fuller House. Yes, I had the I had the wonderful experience of going on the last two seasons of Fuller House. They invited me on to be to play myself, um, although I got to do some acting as well um, <laughs> with my acting background. And then I was in the grand. Well, hopefully it's not a spoiler. I was in the grand finale as well, and that was really fun. And I have to say, the cast and the 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 crew and everybody who works on the show it was such a wonderful family. You know. I had my kids, my kids are fans of the show as well, and they, we visited the set. Um, well, they visited the set while I was working, and everybody was just so welcoming. The writers wanted to make sure the kids were right up front while we were rehearsing and mm. you know, seeing what was going on behind the scenes, but everybody was just so awesome. Uh, Did you watch the original when, when it was on, Full House? I think I was a little old for it. Yeah. But I know it, and I knew the actors. I had met a number of the actors along the way um, in different TV shows I had done, different events. Um, so it was fun to work with people like Bob Saget, who's hilarious. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, they, I, I, I really loved that show. And, um, you know, you say you were uh, a little old for Full House. I have a friend who's uh, 42, um, and he still watches it whenever it's on Nick at Night. Yeah. So. <laughs> well, now I Never watch it again with my House. kids. <laughs> I know. I watch yeah. it with my kids. I think I just feel like I was a young adult when it came out and I might've been watching not a lot when it, in the early nineties, especially when I got on the radio, that was the first time in a long time I really engaged with pop culture. Like I was very alternative, you know, I would go to the weird movie theaters with the good popcorn. I would never see like a big movie or, you know, on the radio, I would listen to oldies, like stuff, hard, you know, rock from the seventies and, a new wave, but I wouldn't listen to sort of what was on the radio. And then I got on the radio and all of a sudden I wanted to see what else was out there. So I started engaging more with pop culture. Since then I'm, I'm totally engaged. But at that time, I didn't really, you know, I didn't, I didn't know. I didn't, I watched like mystery science 3000, not. Ah, good show, though. Very good yeah, show. Very funny, very funny. 